We are talking to Antrell Roll of the New York Giants. Antrell, welcome. Thank good, you. Good to see you today. Uh, you came to the Giants after several years with the Arizona Cardinals. What's the media situation like in New York City compared to Arizona? Uh, I don't think there's any comparison. I think this is definitely a, a wider base. Um, you know, everything here gets broadcast, you know, immensely over the world. And, um, you know, being here in New York, you know, I think that you have to take the good with the bad. Uh, you know, if you say something, it could be taken uh, either way and, you know, vice versa. So, um, but I mean, for the more important part, you know, it's, it's been great. You know, it's been great here in New York. You know, I'm loving the city, loving the media, um, you know, as far as how is everything being broadcast and just loving the attention overall. Do you ever finish a game and you're like, oh, man, that's so going on the back page of the, the New York Post? <laughs> I think I've had way too many of those encounters out here in New York, but uh, yeah, you know, but it, I mean, that's New York, you know, you have to learn the hard way, and uh, you know, once once you get used to it, um, you know, it, it works in your favor. You've been to the Super Bowl with two different teams, two different coaches. Tell me a little bit about, about the difference between Ken Wisenhunt and Tom Coughlin and their approaches to coaching. Starting with Coach Wisenhunt, Coach Wisenhunt was, he's, he's more of a, uh, you know, a player's kind of coach. He's a younger guy. Uh, you know, he's played the game, so you know, he, he kind of relates to, to the players a little bit more as to, you know, how do you feel about this and how do you feel about this as opposed to Coach Coughlin. It's pretty much Coach Coughlin away of the highway. He's, he's <laughs> somewhat less friendly, it seems. Coach Coughlin is very friendly, though. He's a very friendly guy. He's a caring guy. And, um, you know, he's, he's just very strict and very set in his ways. What we see, what fans see in the games is, is his <laughs> face turns like a, a bright red color and it looks like his head might explode. So that's why, that's why we don't, uh, as fans, we don't like really get the whole like, he's a friendly guy because he doesn't really come off that way yeah. during games. Yeah, he, he is a friendly guy, but you know, in, in the game time situation, you know, head coach, um, you know, he's very, he's very, very, uh, you know, critique. You know, he, 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 loves, he loves to critique and he, he's to the point. You know, he's a guy that he doesn't like any error, he doesn't like any mistakes, although he knows it's going to happen. But if he can prevent it, you know, he tries his best to do so. You shut down Larry Fitzgerald in college and then ended up as his teammate. When you go out there, who do you think is the best wide receiver? Who do you look forward to the least when, you, when you're facing off against, against wideouts? Whew, there's a number of different wideouts. Uh, you know, you can start with Larry Fitzgerald, uh, Andre Johnson, Calvin Johnson. Uh, who you, you know, also shut down in college. Um, yeah, you know, those college days, I think those guys might get the better of me right now if I put out there in the alley with them. But, uh, <laughs> um, you know, the, the, the NFL, you know, presents a, a lot of different threats. You know, you have the, the Mike Wallace, you know, it's, it's, it's so many great receivers in the NFL today. And, um, you know, you have to pick your poison. You also uh, face the threat of sideline camera, camera guys, too. <laughs> How's the knee doing? Uh, the knee is holding up. It's yeah. holding up. Um, you know, like I say, you know, out of all the football I played in my lifetime, you know, it's a cameraman that wipes me out. So <laughs> I think I need to. Uh, I don't know. I'm not. I'm not too happy about that. You cleared him. You cleared him. You just caught him on the uh, on the way up. Yeah. Has the NFL done anything? Are they backing the cameras off the sidelines at all, or is it just something you're gonna have to deal with? To be honest, I don't know. You know, I don't know. I, I think they reinforce the rules a little bit. Um, I think uh, reassuring everyone that they have to take a knee instead of as opposed to sitting down. I'm not, too, I'm not really too sure what happened. You know, I've just been trying to get my knee right so I can come out here and help my teammates. Before the season, you, you, uh, you do things for, for camaraderie, like uh, uh, the, the crazy haircut. Tell me about the, uh, the, the, the yellow dye in your hair, and, and you just go into the barber and say, hey, do whatever. Yeah, you know, he, he, my barber, he's, he's a childhood friend, so um, I just say, you know, give me something wild and wicked and crazy, you know, and, and that's just something, training camp is a long process, you know, it's the same thing over and over, so anything that can give me a little spirit, a little lift, a little booster, um, you know, so be it. So that's just my way of, of going in training camp with a little booster, and, and while I've been doing that, you know, for the past five years, I think I've been to Super Bowl two times within that time, so. Right on, right on. And uh, you also are out here, of course, to uh, talk about a new Chase debit card. Can you tell me about that? Well, yeah, you know, it's a new Chase debit card. You know, we're partnering with Chase and, uh, and MasterCard with the new debit cards, and you can either uh, choose your team logos, either New York Giants or, you know, New York Jets. Uh, with this, with the purchase of this card, you know, you get 15% off merchandise at the team stores, and also you get 15% off any online purchases as well. That's fantastic. I, yep. um, I, I won't be getting one because I'm not a Giants fan, but <laughs> Giants fans would, be, would do well to get one. All right, Antrell Roll, thank you so much. Uh, for more on the NFL, subscribe to SB Nation and check out our Giants blog, BigBlueView.com.
I'm Antro Roll, safety with New York Giants, and please subscribe to the Big Blue View.